The Milwaukee Brewers take on the Los Angeles Dodgers tonight to kick off a four-game series in Milwaukee. Here to help us break down tonight's game and share his picks is Dave Golikoff. What's up, Dave? Life is pretty good, man. How are you doing over there? Doing great, thanks. And we're going to get right into this pitching matchup, all right? Los Angeles sends out their ace, Clayton Kershaw, tonight to face a team ranked 27th in hits per game. Now, this is a matchup that I think Kershaw really needs right now, and he's starting to find his stride a little bit this season. Are you expecting Kershaw to just shut down the Brewers tonight, Dave? I think uh, Kershaw should have a good outing. Uh, Milwaukee, obviously, uh, canning their manager after uh, Sunday. I believe it was after Sunday. They canned him recently mm -hmm. uh, on the weekend. And a little bit of a surprise, but um, they just weren't really cutting the mustard. The Dodgers come into this game playing pretty well. Uh, they've now won, what is it, uh, seven of their last nine games, come in on a four-game winning streak. Kershaw is on the mound, and he should pitch well against the Brewers. Career 1.09 whip against them. Uh, they bat just 216 against him for his career, 305 ERA as well. So the matchup definitely looks good for Kershaw and the Dodgers uh, in this one. Yeah, like you mentioned, the Brewers are taking the field tonight with a new manager. Now, I don't usually like firing of a manager so early on into a season. You know, what do you think this does for the Milwaukee, and does it really change anything? Well, usually a change of a coach fires a team up. Um, I think that, uh, that it's, it's, I agree with you, this early is bizarre. Uh, I'm thinking of Mike Brown with the Los Angeles Lakers when he was fired five games into the season. I mean, I guess we are in May. Um, we have had a month full of baseball, but really, this is super, super early. And it's not as if, I know they weren't playing great. They had higher expectations, but uh, um, yeah, I mean, they are, they are coming off a, a couple wins, so a little bit surprised. 7 and 18 overall is horrible. I think tonight... We'll see if it if it really sparks them. I mean, sometimes when the coaches lost the locker room and the guy gets fired, then you know things turn around. They're happy to see him go. We might see that. Uh, Kyle Loesch is uh, is uh, is is a decent pitcher for the Brewers. Um, he's 0-1 with a 2.25 ERA in his last three starts against the Dodgers, which which isn't that bad. One of those starts, he beat Kershaw. So. I mean, if you believe that the firing will spark this offense a little bit and, and Loesch can pitch like he has in recent meetings with the Dodgers, then you could, uh, you could definitely make a case for Milwaukee here. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see if they rally behind their new coach tonight. Now, Dodgers are favorites tonight. The run total is at seven. I'm looking at the lines. They're really high. I know neither one of us really likes those kinds of, uh, those kinds of high lines. But what do you got for me tonight, Dave? I think uh, the Dodgers probably win here. Kershaw's been really good in his career at Miller Park. He's won all four stars, posted an ERA of .87. So I like the Dodgers here. If you don't like this tall glass of juice, um, you're more than welcome to go with the under. I think under will be a solid play, too. Again, factoring that not only Kershaw's on the mound and his track record in Milwaukee, but also the fact that Loach has pitched pretty well against the Dodgers, too. So... Those would be kind of my two plays, but I'm sticking with the Dodgers as my main focus. And as always, remember to keep it locked right here on SBRPicks.com for all of your MLB previews and predictions.